Hello, welcome back again. Uh, today I'm gonna show you how to make a light and dark mode uh, using a simple and a lightweight uh, JavaScript library called Dark Mode JavaScript, and I will put link below so you can uh, download and use. On your project and the result will be like this there, there will be a button uh, a toggle button so you can switch uh, dark to light and light to dark uh, it's actually simple uh, let's refresh the, uh, the page here this is the default of my web page and we're gonna scroll down and uh, copy all this code uh, you can use this CDN or you can uh, download the file and upload on your uh, time child folder but uh, I will do it fast so I will go I will go use a CDN just copy all and <coughs> pass in a footer script then let's see the result actually quite simple there will be button below here um, my scroll to top button is overlapping with the button so I will add some CSS to make sure the the button here uh, by using Z index 9 I think so we're gonna copy here and this see the background has changed but the element there is element that doesn't change uh, actually you can use uh, automatic solution by using this code but uh, I have tried this the result is not really good uh, we, I will do uh, create some uh, additional CSS to uh, make sure the font uh, here the, the heading and the paragraph uh, is a white uh, right now it's black I'm gonna change it to the white so just copy the code here and um, let's see this head this title post title have uh, h1 element like this Let's copy the class name like this and what well uh, this class is uh, added by a, a script so you can see on the body there is a class name a dark mode activated if I click the button it will rem it will disappear it will back to the original uh, <coughs> layout and if, if I click to the dark mode it will add a dark mode activated class name so you can uh, style your element whatever you like okay let's see and let's save setting and see the result okay let's refresh and the color doesn't change let's see and yeah, because I put a color with zero zero, zero or black 
and I think it's this feel of right uh, the default color like this and self setting and let's check all right this is looking good but there is some element that doesn't has, uh, doesn't change now you can actually add another h3 h3 as heading 3 just copy this put a comma to separate them and change 1 to 3 set setting okay and let's see okay it's good so this one's not looking good it's a oh, uh, oh yeah i don't I, I i did not add an, a color for a link it's like this set setting and red side press okay looking looking nice that this still has a white background color i'm gonna change it one two three okay let's mm. comma again copy and paste again and some Dot and let's save. Oh, it it's still looking. Oh, it, this is wrong. We should add another uh, style because we. we, we I want to change the background color, not a font color. So it will be like this background color. This and set setting. Oops. there is okay i think we need to add a parent class a parent uh the class of the parent element so it will be like this i think okay that's looking good you can change all uh, all style uh, when a toggle button is click everything like this so th this is a simple way i think there is so much a way there's many way to to make a dark and light mode on your web page but i think this is uh, the most easier for me okay uh, so uh, thank you very much for watching and happy coding